Wounded Warrior, and thanks for watching. All right, so since we've been on a medical kick here lately, um, I got this as Valentine's Day present from my awesome, awesome fiance Molly. And uh, I, I showed it in a video for my active shooter kit, and we're going to go through it. I'll show you what I've added and the one thing that I've taken away. Let's get to it. All right, guys, what we have here is the Riker, uh, Riker Nylon Gear Ankle First Aid Kit. I bought this from Amazon, um, and it came stocked with everything you see here except for what I will annotate. All right, now, first things first, um, it is a quality, quality piece of gear. Quality made, um, comes with tie downs for the stuff, which is very, very important. Um, if you've ever done any actual movement or exercise or drills or training with an ankle first aid kit that doesn't have these, you'll wish that, that it did and you'll go out and you'll get one of these. All right, so first things first, uh, let's start with the tourniquet because that's most important in my opinion. So this came with a TK4. I, I'm personally not a fan of TK4s. Um, I feel like there's better stuff out there. Uh, and especially better stuff at my disposal. So I'm going to go ahead and run, uh, in this case, either a cat or uh, this is a recon. So I just uh, stuffed a recon where this TK4 would go. Yeah, it's a little more bulky, but in my opinion, it's a superior design. All right, next year we just have some four inch wide wound stop pressure bandage. I added a Sharpie so I can write on whatever I need to write on, um, and I can write on my target. All right, next up, gloves, gloves, gloves. I touched on this in my other video. When you are amped up and fired up and ready to go and rock and roll, uh, you're going to tear up some gloves. Ask me how I know. Um, it's one of the first things you learn in any kind of uh, class, immediate action medical type class, uh, your, your, your palms are sweaty, you're barfing on, on your sweater and, you know, mom's spaghetti and it's hard to get gloves on and shit. So, all right, gloves, 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 need more gloves, um, pair of shears. Um, this is, uh, this can be the difference between, uh, naked and trauma naked. If you need to get trauma naked, you need some shears. All right. All right. Right here we have a chest decompression needle. Um, this particular one has a catheter and that's my preferred method for relieving tension pneumothorax. All right. So next we have a good old fashioned nasal trumpet, number 28, stuck that off in there. Did not come with, um, this kit, uh, decompression needle also did not come with it. Um, that tourniquet didn't and the Sharpie did not and the gloves didn't, but TK4, got that there. These are extra. All right, next. Duct tape. Duct tape, duct tape. Duct tape did come in this kit. Um, in a compact roll like that. That is amazing stuff. These are the gloves. The Tactical Medic uh, included. That's uh, where I got it off of Amazon. So, um, next we have some more compressed crinkle gauze. I have a copy of my old driver's license in here because more than likely, if this comes off, uh, shit's bad. And so they need to know who is involved, what's going on, and all that. So here, on here, to this end, I wrote my name, call Molly, and my blood type. Because like I said, if this is coming off, shit has gotten way, way sideways. All right, in the back here, bam! Chest seal. That came in that. Um, man, you can you can fake it till you make it with chest seal as far as occluded, occluded dressing and duct tape. But, uh, man, if you got the real thing, shit, makes life so much easier. All right, so we got everything in the kit. This came with the kit. This did not. This is what I added here. What also came with this is an extender because this will fit around um, most people's legs and it'll fit around mine, even even though I sometimes skip leg day. Uh, but 
Um, you can use this extender to get around a boot like that. So, ta-da, now your ankle first aid kit will fit around the boot. Um, this will also work with um, my, Ganko, my Galco ankle glove. I've used it to get around a boot also. The problem you'll eventually run into is your pants are not wide enough. And that's why you get boot cut jeans. Or you just wear fat kid clothes. And, I mean, that's an option too, I guess. Well, I hope, uh, hope I've enlightened you. Um, this quality piece of kit, do not leave home without it. Hope some of the small tips and tricks that uh, I've shown you here today can maybe hopefully save a life someday. So with that, if you like the video, click like button, please like, share, and subscribe. Um, if you like it enough to see me again, of course, click subscribe and ring the bell, and I'll, uh, I'll let you know when I post content. So, all right, guys, appreciate it again. Just remember, when avoidance, deterrence, and de-escalation fail, high rate of fire usually does it.